Ali Shanma on YouTube.com. You have seen many videos. I've received a number of emails about having trouble flying Red Arrow's electric VAE Hawk. So I'm going to put this a step by step flight for all of you Red Arrow's or VAE Hawk owners. Uh, please remember that this is a ducted fan electric jet, so the acceleration is not very quick uh, compared to the propeller driven airplanes. So um, treat it, it's not a trainer plane, so treat it as a little jet because jets need a little place to run. They need to actually get some speed before they can take off. So what uh, many guys wrote to me that when they fly, right after takeoff, the plane will just roll or stall or crash or something like that. It's because you try to take off too soon. So let this baby run for a while. When it has enough speed, take it up very slowly. Don't apply too much elevator. Um, rest is all your control and if you're having trouble with landings, of course, I'm going to demonstrate today once again uh, how to land. All you need to do is decrease the speed, but make sure you do not decrease the speed too much or the plane will simply stall. So let the baby run for a while before taking off and then when landing, make sure you have enough space and make a good approach. Give it a right speed before landing. Radios turn on, antenna stretched. Once again, it's kind of crosswind today. Anyway, should be a good flight. Now, before flight, make sure everything is set and especially check if your ailerons are not reversed. Okay, we're ready? Okay, it's a crosswind again. Okay, here is our runway. I'm gonna take off this way and give it a little run. There's more traffic coming. Do we care about traffic? Please check the distance of how long the plane will run before it takes off. Here we go. Off you go. The aileron on this plane are very responsive. Very, very responsive. So make sure you give it a tiny moment. And when the plane is up high there, uh, don't fly it on full throttle always. God damn it, my, my friend is flying this Nitro T-Rex 600 and we can't hear anything here. But anyways, as you see, off you go. Very smooth. You can give it a little bit of speed if you want to do a nice flyby. So I'm gonna give it a flyby over our heads. Plan your pattern. Give it a nice smooth turn. Give it a little speed. Off you go. Okay, time for landing. A lot. Okay, no problem. Okay. One more yeah. time. Okay, come here. Okay. Damn, don't kill us, okay? Okay, here comes a very smooth turn. Control your elevator. Off you go. I here we are. Now 
You have seen that tricky landing. It's all because of the crosswinds. I had to land very, very fast. Um, one more try. Okay, let's give it one more try. And this time, I will just land it here so you can record it from that side, okay? I think I did my best with the landings. I hope you got the idea. It was all crosswinds. I'm sorry, once again, I couldn't give you a very smooth landing. What you just saw is called a wing assisted land landing. It's like when before the plane crashes, you touch the wing on the ground and let it land.